Hey guys, it's Nikki with This Robin's Nest. So in today's video, I'm gonna share a few finds from Walmart. I don't shop at Walmart a lot, but I was in there picking up a few odds and ends of groceries, and I found some really fun stuff in their home decor department. I'm also gonna put some things that I didn't buy on my Insta stories on Instagram that were really good finds. I just didn't take everything home with me. So if you guys wanna see everything else that I liked but I didn't pick up, you can check out my Insta stories on Instagram, but let's see what I did bring home. Walmart has their Christmas shop open, so I went and took a look, was moseying around, and I found the cutest galvanized houses, metal houses, and they came in different colors. I picked up the silver because I don't think this is just for holiday. You could put this out year round with a little battery operated tea light inside of it. Um, it's just the sweetest thing and if you get Pottery Barn catalogs in the mail like I do and you use them for inspiration, they have houses that look just like these and these are a fraction of the cost. So I think they were $5.97 but they are just so sweet. They have uh, scalloped edges around the side and little cut out windows and the little chimney and they're so very very sweet you guys i would highly recommend that you pick one or two of these up for home decor that you can use all year round so i ended up picking two of those up because i think they really are going to come in handy all year round and i like to decorate in threes for the holidays so i'm going to show you the next item that I got that will go with these guys. So after I was in the Christmas section, I started walking around kind of like home decor and they had the seasonal home decor aisle where they had fabulous farmhouse style finds. And again, I show that a little bit on my Insta stories. I'll probably post that the same day I'm posting the video. I picked one item up from there and it is a larger lantern, tin lantern by Better Homes and Garden, which is totally different than the Christmas shop. So this is about double the size and it's I want to say right around $14 and you could easily fit a Bath and Body Works three wick candle in there. I mean, this is going to be so pretty with a candle lit up inside or a battery operated one um, if you don't like to burn candles in your home. The main difference between this one and the smaller ones is this one seems a little bit more structured. It doesn't have the scallops, so it's not necessarily as whimsical. It's a little bit more modern of um, a house, I guess you would say. So yeah, I was pretty excited when I found all these little houses. They're so cute. This one actually reminds me a little bit of a schoolhouse for some reason. And I would say the Walmart is definitely on the right track with some of their home decor. If you like the um, farmhouse, modern farmhouse style, industrial look, they've got some good stuff right now. Another great item that I saw in the Christmas shop that could actually be for year round is a magnolia wreath, you guys. They had this magnolia wreath. It was $12.97, I believe. I really wish I would have picked up more because this is great for year round or if you like to hang wreaths during the holiday season from your windows, if you have a couple windows in your kitchen, hang them with some ribbon and they are a great affordable price. I'm probably going to hang this on my office door, but I wish I would have picked up a couple more for um, decorating other spaces too. Like. These are just a great size if you have a shelf that you could set on the shelf with other decor around it. It's just a really good size that you don't necessarily find when you see the bigger ones at like Hobby Lobby or through uh, Magnolia um, or the wreaths that they carry for Hearth and Hand. This is just like a little bit smaller than I would say the standard size wreath, but bigger than one that would be too small if that makes sense. It's like the medium guy. <laughs> this also has like the two-toned leaves so you have a darker front and a lighter back so if you want to give it a little bit more of a textured look you can uh, manipulate the leaves around and also I noticed that these pull in and out so you could even adjust where you wanted your leaf placement to be on the magnolia wreath and the back side is um, just like this little twig wreath that if you wanted to use it for something else you could take the leaves out and use it as a base so I thought this was a great deal for $12.97 and I have a feeling these and the little galvanized houses will probably sell out pretty quickly. Again, this was in the Christmas shop area, you guys, not like regular home decor. So look in the Christmas section if you want to find it. The final item that I picked up at Walmart was located in clothing department, in pajamas actually. Don't ask me why I was in there. I really never go and look at clothing at Walmart. Not that there's anything wrong with it. I just have never checked out their clothing but I was walking by the pajama section and I saw this shirt it caught my eye and I was like oh you're coming home with me um it is really really cute it says baby it's cold outside and it is 
the softest shirt I have ever felt. It reminds me of that brand at Nordstrom. I think Barefoot Dreams is what it's called. It's just super soft and cozy. You guys, this shirt or pajama top was, I believe, $9.97. And it is so adorable. It looks like it was actually, the lettering was stitched onto the shirt. It just has that cozy feel, just the font, the way it looks like yarn on the front of the shirt. And I'm actually going to wear this as a top. Uh, with jeans or leggings and it's not pajamas for me I'm gonna wear this out so uh, I thought it was a really really great find and they had another one that was I want to say it was like maroon and it said snuggle I think they didn't have it in my size or I would have picked up both because it's just such a great price have you guys ever bought clothes from Walmart before you'll have to let me know what you thought about the quality the longevity because um, I just have no idea but those are the items that I found at Walmart recently, and you guys, I think I'm going to do some searching there again. I had a lot of fun. I don't know if it was just on a whimsy that I found such great things, but it kind of got me excited to go there um, and check out home decor and stuff, other things that I've never looked to Walmart for um, in the past, maybe in the future. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I will see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye.